Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, I'm going to be unboxing my Twisted Retreat for the month of June. I'm so excited. Um, Twisted Retreat is one of my favorite boxes that I receive every month. So yeah, let's just go ahead and open it. So here's the box and how that looks like. Um, so the first thing I want to get is the spoiler card, which is right here. And I don't know the, I don't remember the theme of it, but yeah. Anyways, so here's this product card. So the first item that I'm seeing here is this right here. Is this box. I'm not really sure what it is, but yeah. So let's go ahead and open it. it Does it say on the box? I think it's a diffuser or a diffuser thingy. So yeah. Okay. So here it is. It's black with some rose gold dick detailing on it and that looks really really nice it does say fire burns and encouraging bubble with a little wave here and i'm gonna insert a clip overlay so you guys can see it and how it works and stuff you guys will see it from the clip on how that works and yeah that's a really cool item so the next thing we have is this little brown bag i have no idea what it is so let's go ahead and open that up and I forgot, I was going to check the spoiler card for the other thing, so I'll check it in a minute. I have no idea what this is. So I figured it out. So it is a um, wine chime thingy. It looks very, very pretty. It's absolutely gorgeous. I mean, it's, you guys can see from the close-up video, but I love it. I love the moons. I love the little crystals, the rocks. The coffin, the bath, this is so pretty. Um, I'm not gonna hang it up outside. I'm probably just gonna hang it up in front, somewhere in my room, to be honest, because this is absolutely beautiful. Um, yeah, I really love this. This is gorgeous. Um, so yeah, this is the bath and coffin wine chime. Make your windows a bit creepier with the sun catcher slash wine chime designed by Melanie Rose Bucks. This is a Twisted Retreat exclusive. So I'm pretty sure this was made by the creator, designed by the creator of Twisted Retreat and an Unplug. And it's beautiful, I love it. So I'm very happy with this item, it's gorgeous. Okay, and then for the other thing, the, so it's a Macbeth flame diffuser. So go up in flames with a spooky diffuser inspired by Macbeth, filled with diluted essential oil through the humidifier. And the flames make it look like fire, but don't worry, it's just a cool effect. And it was designed by LY underscore Barry for this box. So yeah, that's really cool, and I'm excited to use the diffuser as well. Okay, moving on. So then we have this purple baggie here. I don't know if it focused, but yeah, we have this big purple bag. And it says Twister Retreat The Fog. Uh, shower steamers. Okay, so it smells really good. But yeah, we just have a whole bunch of shower steamers here, different colors. So we have a purple one, um, like a oop, like a light blue, a white one, a pink one, and an orange one. And we have like a cyan green one that fell on the ground, but I'm not gonna pick that up right now. So yeah, I'm really happy with these. I like using shower steamers, so I'm really happy with that. Um, so yeah, I'm loving this box so far. The next thing we have is the River Has Tea, um, Riddle Shop, Riddle's Tea Shop and Curiosities. Um, so yeah, this is a Twister Tree exclusive. Um, I'm not a tea person. I haven't really tried tea, to be honest, but I've been getting a whole bunch of tea strainers from all my other subscription boxes. So I'm gonna try this out and hopefully I like it. Um, so yeah, I'm not really sure what the flavor is, to be honest. But I'm gonna smell it and see if it smells good at least. It smells really good actually. It smells very sweet. So I'm excited to try it out, but I don't know. I hope to become a tea person. Like I wanna just become a tea person, make some tea and read some books. Like that sounds like a nice time. Like normally I stick to coffee, but yeah, hopefully it tastes good. <laughs> okay, so the next two items um, I just grabbed because they're like, 
to go together. So the first one is some sunglasses, um, which I guess I should probably show you guys this. I mean, it's it's cool. Mm, Will I wear them? I don't really wear sunglasses in general. Um, yeah, they look fun. They look cool, I guess. I mean, I don't know. Probably doesn't really. I feel like I look weird with sunglasses, to be honest. But yeah, that's cool. And it's not my favorite item, but it's cool enough. But I actually like the um, sunglasses case better. Like, I think um, the sunglasses case is stunning. Like, the artwork on it, the skulls, the crystals, the sparkles on it is so cool looking. So, I'm like, and it feels good. I feel like it will protect my glasses on sunglasses. So, I'm happy with the case of it. Um, so yeah, I like the sunglasses case uh, a lot more, um, but they're both pretty cool looking either way. Um, so the skull sunglasses protect, um, they're not inspired by anything. And then the sunglasses case, which is a bonus item. Um, so they say surprise, we included an extra item. This exclusive sunglasses case is perfect to store your sunglasses and, and to protect them. So yeah, I'm really happy with that. That's really cool. And we don't get no candle this month. Which, uh, I don't think we're gonna get a candle for a couple of months um, until like the fall but we do have our Twitter retreat um, tarot card that usually matches the candle but yeah this was really cool um, this was the call of the Cthulhu I, I don't know how to pronounce it I'm very bad at pronouncing things but you know this is inspired from HP Lovecraft and stuff like that so and this is to represent the deaf major arcana and yeah anyways yeah i these are fun to collect for some reason i like them and i think oh wait no there's one more item and this actually goes with the diffuser that we got earlier it's a oil thingy fuser thingy so this it says wake the dead and per lemon essential oil so yeah it, it looks, the packaging is nice. I like the little design on it. So I'm gonna go ahead and smell it. Yeah, it smells like lemon. So yeah, this smells good. And I actually did um, receive one in Unplug as well. That smells like oranges. So these are really, really nice. I like them. They, they both smell really good. Oh, actually there's another item that was hidden underneath the book. And it is a metal bookmark. And I love metal bookmarks. I love receiving metal bookmarks. They're my favorite things to receive. And this is so cool because it's, it's the shape of a coffin. Like, I'm always happy to receive bookmarks, but especially metal bookmarks. They're so gorgeous. And this one says, everybody is a book of blood. Whenever we're open, we're red. And it's a beautiful, beautiful design on here. So I'm happy with this and hopefully we get more metal bookmarks because I just love them. I can never get off too many metal bookmarks. I'm always happy with them and especially when they look this cool. Um, let's see here. I'm trying to find it. Okay. Bugs of Blood Enamel Bookmark. This gorgeous exclusive enamel bookmark is inspired by Cleve Baker's Book of Blood and it was designed by Arzar.art um, and it was exclusive for this box. So yeah this is really cool and i love it so yeah um surprisingly i not surprisingly because i always love this box but i love everything um the only thing that is just kind of like meh is just the sunglasses but that's just me just because i'm not a sunglasses person because i mean either way it still looks pretty cool but i love the sunglasses case and that was an extra item so i mean overall i'm still very impressed with this box um, so I'm happy. But anyways, let's move on to the actual book for this month. And it is No Gods, No Monsters by Cadell Cadwell Turnbell. Turnbell. <laughs> so definitely mispronounced that, but it's okay. Um, so we got the shrink wrap, which is pretty easy this month. So here is the cover. I love the gold foiling on the actual hardback there. Beautiful. Then we have the spine there. And we have the back here. Um, so the, uh, I love this cover. This cover is beautiful. I love the gold falling on the hard back. So stunning. So here is the top spray edges. And then here's the bottom. They're different and they look cool. 
and then we have the side edges and again i feel like twitter retreat and unplug like their boxes they'd be doing such an amazing job with their edges so it's like a forest you have the moon there it looks stunning all three sides are different but they're so beautiful so i'm happy with that um so yeah so let's go ahead and take off the dust jacket we have nothing on the reversible side there Ooh, okay so on the naked hard pack i'm like i feel like they do some of the greatest beautiful books so we have the front naked hard back here and in this orange tone um falling in like a silver goldish falling on the other wolf here i think there was but they're very very pretty then we have the spine and the spine on its own looks so cool as well and then the back which is the snake and again you have the two different um falling colors on there and it's absolutely stunning so they did such a great job with this book then we have the inner papers uh, they're pretty simple they're always like twitter tree always do simple um in pages but they always look nice so it's okay i like that um i think is it oh do we not have a digital signature or anything like that i don't think so i heard they always put a digital signature at least I don't see any, so whatever. It's okay. I don't really mind, but yeah, this book is beautiful, and I'm very happy with this. Um, and I'm excited to read it. So yeah, so let's go ahead and find out what it's about. Normally, I don't read like the summaries of these books um, out loud just because I. Don't know how to pronounce a whole bunch of words, like it's pretty bad. But let's give it a try. One October morning, uh, Lena gets the news that her brother has been shot and killed by Boston cops, but what looked like a case of police brutality soon reveals something much stranger. Um, monsters are real and they want everyone to know. As creatures from myth and legend come out of the shadows seeking safety through visibility, their emer. <sighs> Emergence sets off a chain of similarly unrelated events. Members of local werewolf packs are thrown into silence. A professor follows a missing friend's trial of breadcrumbs to a mysterious secret society. And a young boy with unique abilities seeks ref ref oh my god. Refri re refuge in a pro monster organization with secrets of its own. Meanwhile, more people start disappearing. Suicides, so hate crimes increase, and protests are brought globally, both for and against the monsters. At the center is a mystery no one thinks to ask. Why now? What has frightened the monsters out of the dark? The world will soon find out. So yeah, this sounds really interesting, and I'm excited to give this a read. Hopefully soon, because it sounds so good. And this edition, it's just absolutely gorgeous. So I'm excited. I love all the items and the book. Let me know your thoughts of the book and on the items. Uh, make sure to like, comment below, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.